Hello everyone, are you ready for another spooky adventure? It's me, Wookie, I'm back with another 13 Nights of Halloween. I should not say I'm back, because this is officially the first of the 13 Nights of Halloween featuring The brand new guests. 13 Nights of Halloween. The well, very this first time. Slightly, this is the first one of the 13 Nights. I'm here with my first guest, which is Spoot. Say hello, Spoot. Hi! What's He's over from everybody? Fort Misery, who are two dudes who help a whole bunch. Who I talked to, I yeah, to although we are uh, we are in a, a hard content drought right now. We uh, are the only game we were really covering was Sino Alice, and I was like, man, I'm fucking bored of this, so I stopped doing. It. Oh yeah, the the life of doing a gotcha YouTube anything, right? <laughs> well, I think we're uh, I think we're picking back up when uh, the slime game comes out because he's pretty interested in that too. So we may split that, but uh, yeah, we both just been bored. Like I've been streaming a little more lately, so that's kind of what I'm focusing on. So that's where Spoot comes from. And also just to explain, the 13 Nights of Halloween is something I do every night. For this year, I decided that I should have uh, 13 guests based off of the Scooby-Doo series, the 13 Ghosts of Scooby-Doo. Scooby-Doo. Scooby which was Scooby-Doo. Uh, this is the Scooby-Doo series that had Vincent Price in it. it was which is the best series if you're just going off of Vincent Price, really. Yes. And in general, in all of scooby doo -um, it's the only series that never got an actual season finale. It had an, an ongoing story, and then 20 years later, they finished the story. <laughs> it had some pretty consistency, like consistent internal lore in the beginning, but yeah, it was, it was a little weird. Why, why? What? Are they just stuffing a body into a box? I think so. So this is... Why is she... What? This is a From Software game called Kuon, and this is going to be our first spooky game that sets the tune tone from this. So let's... wait, hold on. The ghost has two ghost Oompa Loompas. I, I don't know. What's... So let me tell you what I know about. First of all, let's look at the settings. We have settings, begin, and load. So let's just. Oh, I've got a load. Huge load. I can all right. So how? Let, let me ask you a question. Go ahead. How are you at like general horror games? Because I don't give a shit. Like I play Phasmophobia by like screaming at the ghosts. Uh, actually terrified at every single game. Really? Yes. I am, proud of you. I am constantly scared of everything. I think I, I don't know if I told, I've told, I've said this in videos, but I'm the kind of dude that goes to um, Halloween Horror Nights with my uh, siblings, is terrified the entire time, is constantly fucking sh shaking in fright and has a good time. Ah, uh, dude, we went to, uh, so when Fort got married, he wanted to do Halloween Horror Nights for his bachelor party, so we yeah. went. And, like, I was just so fucking bored. <laughs> like, I can imagine I like, if you don't scare easy, it would be very, like... Uh, oh, yeah. Like, well, some of the set pieces were really interesting. I liked the set design. But, like... Oh, yeah, I think in terms of actual set design, uh, it's hard to kind of go up for um, against that. Especially if you love, like... Especially some of the themes that they've done recently with, like, Beetlejuice and Ghostbusters. Yeah, the Beetlejuice one was really sick. We When we went, they had just started doing the... Uh, the hallmark of horrors that had like Freddy Krueger and um, the Va and, and Dracula and Frankenstein and all those. So that was a really cool set piece. Yeah, that sounds cool. But you were there just completely bored, I assume, because nothing was really scaring you. Yeah, I'm just I'm just sort of wandering through, and even like the scare people are like, okay, we get this asshole. So they're scaring people in front and behind me, and they're kind of just ignoring me. And I'm like, I don't know if I feel good about this. <laughs> So, when my very first time at Halloween Horror Nights with a, uh, fr I went with friends instead of my siblings, and I had a friend there who was a good, very good friend of mine. He was a fantastic artist. He was an artist who used to put on porn as inspiration for his drawings. He used to draw fucking good man. awesome sickness. But on the first year of Halloween Horror Nights, I almost fucking punched him because he was very hard to scare but he was definitely one of those persons who's like he's like my dad like my dad would go into a horror maze in universal and he would clap and go yes yes as other people got scared yeah I, my fight or flight kicks in violently so like when i get scared i start swinging or if something like startles me i swing so like i almost jacked my cousin in the <laughs> face when he tried to like we were i went downstairs to like do something in the laundry room and he like jumped out behind like one of the dog bins and like I hit the dog bin instead of him, and he was just like, "What the fuck, dude?" I'm like, "You don't jump out of people. I'll fucking hit you." <laughs> so when I went to Horror Nights, yeah, that's what my friend totally did. Is that he decided to join in on the scaring and scare me as one of them, and I was like, "You are so fucking. Cl I can't hit back any of these people because they're not my friends. I don't know. I'm like, I can hit I you. I can hit you, <laughs> and you're lucky yeah. that you're faster than me. Otherwise, you would already be getting hit right now." 
Let's That's go. just wild. All right, so this is a From Software game. Oh, uh, yeah, From Software. Before You're... they were known for Dark Souls, this is their Cookies and Cream era, a.k.a. the Golden Age of From Software. Well, this is, they had this going on. They had uh, King's Crusade or King's Bounty. I think it's Kingsfield at this point, isn't it? Kingsfield, yeah. And then you had the uh, um, Armored Core series, Armored too. Core. There you go. Yeah, Everybody God, those games good. are so fucking good. Yeah, it's a shame they don't do those anymore. Uh, considering the technology, what yeah. yeah. You need to be careful. N a nice no lip flap. <laughs> this is how you can tell this is peaks from software from long ago. Don't worry about this. Well, I mean, this was every PS2 game. Like they, they were like, "Yo, it costs a lot to animate lips, so we just ain't gonna fucking do it." Everything but like Final Fantasy X, and especially because in this, this would. I think that was one of the big things for X was it and Legend of Dragoon were like the first two big one. What the fuck was that guy doing? Did you see that dude? I didn't see. What is it? What is it? Dude, just like he's shuffling around. I didn't see any shuffle. Don't don't tell me that they're shuffling around here. Dude, look above you. He's like hanging out behind the tree. Don't don't fucking lie to me. Is there He's hiding behind the tree. Do you not see his There's legs? There's a dude behind the tree. Yeah, when you walk around, he like it... runs away from you. What a dick. What? Sir? There's been a murder? What? Oh. <laughs> okay, I guess he just He knows. Away. Yeah, he's he was... booking it. He's like I ain't getting, I ain't getting stuck for this. Fuck 12. What is that? Did you see him run? Yeah, what is going on? He runs like me. <laughs> oh god, the hammer shake. Tempest. Some areas Some have areas. Large amount of negative energies. This includes revenge, murder, grudges. It too has been accumulated when a tempest of negativity may occur. If a tempest is encountered while running, you may experience vertigo. Wow, great! <laughs> Finally, a game that gives me vertigo. <laughs> I've only ever gotten vertigo once in like at all, and it was in Minecraft, and I felt really embarrassed about it. And usually, I don't tell people that. So there you go. That's your fun secret fact from Spoot. There you go. Um, I get vertigo all the time because I'm afraid of heights. Uh, I don't know if I'm afraid of them. I'm not particularly uncomfortable around them. So I don't know. Wait, what? Wasn't that? So, didn't you just show up here with her? Like, where the fuck's she going? Yeah, I don't know where she's going. I think this. Why is can't you hop over these rocks? Because I'm a dainty Japanese lady. We don't just go in the bushes. Shit. Yeah, yeah. She's like, I'm gonna circle around. You can go through here, by the way. You can if you want. Listen, if I've learned anything from Silent Hill, there used to be a dog here. <laughs> That's gonna be the end reveal for this game. Is gonna be the dog. All right, I'm afraid to run now because I'm act. This actually because there's a there's a ghost dude up here that's like waggling arms. Yeah, this actually controls pretty nice. Maybe this is just because I'm coming off of playing Monster House with Toast, where that game controlled. Oh like, the man, worst. Monster House had to have control like ass. Absolute ass. Yo, like, shinies. Shinies, metal spike, demon suppressing spike. I don't know what that does, but sure. Silkworm disc, disc decorated with a silkworm carving. All right. And blood oozing from the wound has soaked the ground. Spike that bitch. <laughs> yeah, let me just quickly desecrate this body. Even if, is that? Oh, look, he's back. He's okay. eating the body. He is eating the body. Okay, so I'm gonna go obviously this way, right? Can I go to the shrine. There's something in the shrine. Do you want to get? Yeah. Why not? Well, duh. Oh, it's a map. I have a map now and a scroll. Oh. Basic survival. Do not run. Be as quiet as possible. If you make any noise, a gothi will detect your presence. Oh, so okay. just don't run. Okay. What the oh, fuck's a gaki? Oh, hey, what's up, dude? Uh, what, he wants it blood. It just told me not to run. So I just oh, it's rape. Still... It's rape time, baby. Oh god. I don't know what you're just... supposed to do. Yeah, just run. Fuck it. I no, I'm cool. I'm just gonna ignore him for now, and he will stop. That's Is how. It... It... If you ignore them, they just go away. I think so. Well, he you may need to like heal. What? No, there's kids. No please. Why are there so many dead people inhabiting other dead people? Blood is drenched in blood. Let's see. I don't know. I don't trust Follow them this. kids. Yeah, that seems like that's a good idea. That's never led to anyone dying. That's some Scooby-Doo shit going on. Let's see. Hello. Oh, no. There's nothing over here. Can't do anything over here? Well, that sucks. This is also like old-style Resident Evil uh, camera. It's got the old tank controls. Not tank controls, but it has the camera. You know the camera? That oh, it, yeah, it yeah. It's it's fixed camera, but not fixed controls. Yeah, like, exactly. So not yeah, yeah, no, yeah, no tank you. controls, but, like, every new... Tank controls were, like, fucking awful. 
Yeah, they were. So that's that's how Monster okay. House was like. Was it? it? Oh god! It had tank controls. Very There's more blood. blood. There's a lot of blood. All right, let me talk to the blood. No, no. Oh, god, fucking damn it! That really did get me. <laughs> this stupid corpse up here. Blood had to come from somewhere, Wokey. I didn't expect it. What the fuck? I didn't see shit. The dude lost all his blood. It's fine. God. All right, let me go up here. It do seem like it does seem like I am kind of injured, but it doesn't seem like the injury is holding me back, which is good. I would actually hate it because I hate it when um, uh, Resident Evil is really bad about this. When you're like super low health, you can't do shit. Like you're super. Oh, you slow. get like. Hold on. Check out your inventory. You may have just got a spell. Huh? Yeah, I think so. Now, let me see. Jesus. Ooh, I don't like how blurry that shit gets. That's like, ooh. That's not great. Healing herbs crushing. Oh, I can heal myself. Right. You're not. You're not clutching your breast anymore. What was that? Did I just take out a fucking knife? Dude, you got a fucking demon spike. It's time to go, bitch. I think you're right. I do have, in fact, a demon spike. So let me see. What is this sacred cloth? It's now. Listen, God may be in heaven, but it's up to <laughs> us to exercise the demons. You got a point there. Card and weapon selection. When a triangle or a square is equipped to card, you can use any time you're pressing the button. When a button is not assigned to a card, just press the standard weapon attack as before. All right, so your standard so, weapon attack is a blade. <laughs> I studied the blade. I studied the blade. Why All right, so you get arrows. I got fucking arrows. So that's cool. I, I only have nine of them, so I'm going to be very smart about how I actually use yeah, them. Yeah, that's fine. I mean, I wouldn't use them in general, but like having them is pretty sick. I mean, if I had a spell that just made me summon arrows to shoot at dudes, I would be using it left and right. I feel like I'd be in a grail war at that point, and I don't want to have anything to do with that. It's drifting out of the shrine. Could there be an open space inside it? Obviously. I gotta collect all of these. So oh, the silkworm thing's gonna be here. Right. Yeah, sure. Let's do it. Shrine puzzle. Once three wins. Ah. Uh, I need three more, so I need to actually go back. Because I don't have three yet. Right? I only have two. Yeah, you've only got you've got one disc and one spike. This is not where the thingies were. Alright, I'm gonna go back out and look for them then. Oh, is that something there? Alright. Now I'm actively gonna start shit with this guy. Oh, oh no, it's I, fucking doesn't, time, baby. Doesn't look like I can, so he's he's I think you gotta go time. around. Ancient Japan, man. It's hard to be a Japanese lady. They always have to adhere to proper etiquette even during a terrible ghosting situation it's very odd it is very odd but i'm gonna assume that this makes what hey what up kids are oh, they're singing they're all dead and they're speaking oh, no English. shit yes they're all dead it's terrifying language aiko is the last one living Let's see if I can put it a little bit louder. I feel like the intro music was much louder than. Uh, that's a common PS2 thing. Is she still really alive? <clears throat> the recorded videos or the CG videos tend to be. Hey, where are you kids going? Well, that's fucking rude. It is very rude. I agree. Lady Fujimara is in Mermerium? No, dressed. Milady, I have placed the remaining wooden disc in the Milady. <laughs> Milady. <clears throat> Milady. Don't worry about the two spikes. I've entrusted them to Miss Ayako and the seer who's here inspecting the manor. Two of you are gonna hide in the garden. Please take care of yourself. And then that guy died. Yeah, that guy absolutely died. Something must have jumped into the pond, but it's too dark to tell. I bet it was those kids going for a midnight swim. You rascals. Or are you? Time to stab that hoe. Yeah, I'm about to open fire on this man. But I bet I can avoid him if I just hold on. Wrong! <laughs> These cards give you guys as magic spells. These cards give you used only once. Got him! Oh shit, I didn't get him. Alright, shoot him again. Are you kidding me? This man takes multiple fire arrows to the face? This seems unfair. What a hardy fucking dude. So it's it takes 
four fire arrows to kill a demon. I guess he is a demon. So that so. automatically makes me think that, like, maybe we should just avoid them. He's got... There's something there. Hmm. You have to cleanse yourself in the waters of the Lake Minnetonka. Perhaps. Maybe that's what I have to do here at the end. There's more than one, maybe? It's this guy. It doesn't like that it's near me. So it's a, like warning me that there's something there. But for now, I need to go. Oh? Okay. Rick, check his butt for loot. Yeah. Try to stab the butt, but nothing. I don't know. Nothing, nothing in the prison wallet, huh? Nothing so far. Nothing that I can see. Goats. Oh god. I'm gonna oh, go that sucks. The, the the forest of insta death and go this way for a bit. Oh. Did that dude just <laughs> God fucking <laughs> damn, they need to stop doing that? It's You saw the item fall first, you knew you were dead. What were the chances? <laughs> I mean doing it twice. The resonance of the manor are disappearing and none of them have returned alive. Sometimes their corpses are discovered and they are always horrible to behold. Some of them are killed with bamboo spears. Others were discovered under the eaves and but were unrecognizable. Only bits of their flesh remained. I too have suffered from the same fate. Wait. Did he I may this suffer. as he was dying? No, he's he's he wrote that before he died. He was like, I am worried that I will suffer the same fate. Joke's on him, he did. He did. He did. <gasps> he's the prophet! He is the prophet. He knows exactly what's going to happen. He knew. Every time I see someone fall, it does remind me of the joke. I forget which comedian said, but if you're going to fall, do a cart flip. Do a so cart that wheel. the people who, as you go down, get a show. Yeah. All right. So there's pretty much nothing here. I think I need to find the other spikes. There's nothing here. So I need to go back and look for stuff. What is this? <clears throat> Did I come through here? I don't think so. I have a map, don't I? Uh, I believe so. Yeah. yeah. What do you mean, unavailable map? Oh, this is not good. Okay. There you go. So where am I now? You're at the mulberry tree. It's not a very useful map. I cannot move forward. So I think I'm at the shrine right now. Let's assume I'm there. I swear, from software. This feels like from software, maybe. Oh, that is where you came from. This looks familiar. Yeah. Although from a slightly different angle? Yeah, it seems a little bit. Oh, nope, it's... they came and got the body. What a bunch of jerks. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that was our, our friend who was attacking me. Maybe we can... I mean, they could at least mop up. Like, this is just rude. It is extremely rude. Very un-Japanese as well. Right? Like, you don't get invited into somebody's house and just, like, leave your stuff and blood all over the place. Like, it's super rude. At least you don't try to. Guardian tree is like... Oh, shit! This guy! <laughs> God damn it! I'm gonna try and knife you. The knife is quicker. Ah, God damn it! Get off me! Get him! Oh, come on. Come on, fool. Eh, it's about the same amount of effort, and you're not wasting a resource, so... That's true. Maybe know. it's better for far away dudes. Oh, God. I'm sure there's going to be, like, some strong, stupid demon you run up on where you're like, Man, I don't get anywhere close to that. Yeah, kind of exactly is what <gasps> Cutscene time. Yo, we hiding now? You literally just fought a demon, like, straight up. What's he going to do to me? Oh, she's about to get it. What? Wait. Oh, ghost dog. Yo, she gets to summon ghost dogs and we get stupid arrows? We may have picked the wrong character. This we did pick the wrong character. We could have been... <laughs> who's that Who's that kid from Jujutsu Kaisen? Oh, right. oh damn it. I know exactly who you're talking yes, about. Yes, I think so. I was God, thinking of Zen's, his name. Zen's Zen going to watch this and be like, ah, just scream the whole time. I am Uski. Exactly. I live in the shrine. Well, exactly what we're talking about. Pretend who we don't who we don't know who Gojo is, just to absolutely send him into a heart attack. 
Yeah. I'm looking oh, I remember Gojo's name. It's the the, the little dude that's with him. <laughs> the, it's the, yeah, it's he the makes shadow puppets. Came from yeah. the mountain. All of his all of his little animals are shadow puppets. Man, yeah, no, I can't remember his name. It's not safe to be alone here. You don't I'll say tell you in like two seconds. I wish I could help you find your sister, but busy. Here, take this. It will help you. She gives her Megumi Fushiguro. Megumi, there you go. Wait, oh, yeah. it looks similar to the one father uses. Your father is the priest, correct? Here, no take this. My father gave this to me. You may find oh, it. Oh, I bet useful. if you pick because of the character I oh. picked, I bet if it was the other way around, Thank I would be you. playing as that character, and then at this point we would Please. swap items when be I had that item. I will. Maybe. And thank you. Take care. Thank you. Spell card. Hibari. Fiery arrow. Hell yeah. Summon card. Oh, we can summon an arachnid? Summon card. Saiga. Wolf that fiercely... Oh, you only get two of those. So I have to be smart with them. Yeah, that's like boss fight stuff. Yeah, we should save them. But still, I can't... Before this video ends, we do have to summon at least the spider and... The wolf. Yeah, if you don't plan on if you don't plan on finishing the game, why not? Yeah, let's see, where were we? Although being fair, we've already gotten two very solid jump scares out of you, so I already feel pretty uh, pretty pretty <laughs> happy about the whole thing. Let's also stop for now, and we'll do we'll continue in the next part here, just so I don't have to worry my internet <laughs> by trying to upload twenty minutes at a time. So thank you very much, everyone, for joining us so far. Join us for another part for more Thirteen Nights of Spooky stuff going on. Say goodbye, Spook. Goodbye, Spoot. Thank you. You're finally you're the first person ever to actually do the joke right. Because I've been <laughs> I've been I've been doing it with Zen for fucking years and I've said say goodbye, Zen, and every single time he just says, Alright, goodbye. And yeah. every, everyone does that. I am nothing if not good at comedy timing. Fair. <laughs>